Look, I've been doing this long enough to have heard it all, or most of it anyways. Who wants to look natty? Natural physiques just aren't all that impressive to me. I wanna compete against the best, things like that. And I can understand why a lot of people would feel this way. The coverage that the sport receives quite often is pretty lackluster. So there's this amazing world going on over here, but as the old saying goes, if a tree falls in the woods and there's no one there to hear, you know. But today, I wanna do something a little bit different for you guys and actually just give you snippets of the coverage that I feel the sport deserves and its fans deserve and its potential, maybe new fans, maybe after today's video, deserve. So no, this is not gonna be, you know, the typical 640 by 480 uh, video that someone's dad took from like 40 feet away while trying to fight the stage lights. But an actual up close and personal experience as to what the 2021 WNBF Worlds pump up room look like. So anyone who has had the chance to be backstage at a show, there comes a point where you look around and you're like, whoa, where did all these freaks come from? It's even more like that when we're talking about a world class show such as WNBF Worlds. And I can already hear some of the pushback. Well, Bert, these are genetic outliers. There's a good chance, a good probability here that the average bodybuilder is not going to be able to achieve a physique like the ones in this video. And I agree. But my counter argument here is the fact a lot of the folks who, and this is the majority of us, right? We we draw inspiration from people who have already, you know, gotten theirs. A lot of people out there, they draw inspiration from genetic outliers anyways. They just happen to be on the enhanced side of the sport. So to me, that kind of nullifies that argument. So some of you guys, look, might see this video, might not be moved at all, and that's fine. Your body, your choice, and I 100% mean that. But hopefully some of you guys out there who were considering super supplementation might see this video and it gives you guys something to think about. Another option that, hey, that looks pretty appealing as well in its own way. Now, before I roll on with uh, this footage, uh, I will say this, because I think it's an important point, and that is the fact that there were no female athletes here, and the main reason for that is because, look, a lot of these women were getting ready for what is quite possibly one of the biggest, if not the biggest show of their competitive career, and the last thing I wanted to do was distract them by me rolling around with like my creep cam without like, the official media badge. And the majority of the men who you see in this video, they knew who I was, they knew who I was doing. And as you can see via the body language, mostly the very generous uh, posing, they were excited to be filmed. And as a matter of fact, a lot of those guys afterwards were asking about when am I going to upload this? Can I see what you got? So that's the reason why maybe next year, uh, we can do something like this uh, for the female side because the physiques on that end are just as impressive in their own way. So um, so shout outs to you ladies too. You guys put it down. You guys didn't make it onto this video, but you guys looked amazing. But also as a side note here, even though there was no female athletes here, in my experience, quite often the way a lot of women start using anabolics, it's because not just because they were pushed to do it by a coach, but quite often it is a boyfriend, a male significant other who makes it seem like, you know, it's just Anavar. And by the way, Anavar is a steroid. Uh, it, it, it is like 100% is a steroid and they don't necessarily know what they're signing up for. So hopefully um, this helps a lot of female bodybuilders in an indirect way. With that said, let's uh, get a rolling with the video. Special thanks to the WNBF and to their official media provider, Better Aesthetics, uh, Nick Colville, you, especially you, for allowing me to film backstage and, uh, and get all this amazing footage. And a special, special thanks to all the amazing athletes who were part of this video. You guys are going to hopefully help a lot of people and inspire a lot of people once they see what you guys brought on that day.